let's have some AK fun. <laughs> uh, what is up my awesome YouTube friends? How are you all doing? And welcome back to Seven Days to Die, where we have just cleared, cleared. We have just cleaned up the um, the daily horde or the nightly horde. So if you want to watch that, you know, watch the previous episode. Um, today we're going to be hopefully expanding on our little killing uh, killing area here, just upgrading it, doing a couple of missions, hopefully finding some more uh, knowledgeable stuff. Um, Probably trying to move our stuff from the camping spot um, to somewhere, I don't know, if we might dig down or in or whatever. But yeah, that is the plan for today. This is the current crap that we have on us. Um, let me see, should I actually go back and get rid of stuff or should we just carry on working is the question. Make a couple of frames and carry on building. Okay, so the idea is I just, you know, laid a couple of things down here just to get my bearings on what we're going to be doing. So, yeah, we're going to be uh, extending this and just pretty much making ourselves a way to get in this because this is all going to be closed area uh, for now. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do right here. Um, hopefully, I've got things marked out correctly. One, two, three four and five very good excellent stuff indeed So I guess today is day seven. Today the Horde Knight is going to be tougher uh, than the ones that we have faced already. Uh, this Horde Knight... Uh, why did I dig that far down for? Um, stupid me. <laughs> so yes, the Horde Knight that we're going to be going up against tonight is going to be more tougher than the ones that we've had so far. Um, the ones that we're going to be seeing tonight, you know, that's probably going to last until 4 in the morning, I believe. Um, that's what usually what usually happens. Let me just get some more dirt. Just fill that in. So, yes, do hope that you are kind of looking forward for tonight's uh, Horde Night to see what the hell is going to happen on day 7. Will we survive? <laughs> Will they destroy us completely? Another 50 of these because we're gonna have to try to level this place out. This is gonna be a right headache um, And this is one of the reasons why I said, you know, perhaps I should just build this on a more flatter area What, a, what an absolute mess. <laughs> what an absolute mess. Um, yeah. So hopefully here we can have a, a door or a garage door or a something sort of a, that resembles a door and uh, allow us to, you know, go through and across uh, this way. So let's just get those down as well. Okay, it's four in the morning. Let us uh, actually now we'll keep the gamma as it is because it's still going to be a bit dark for you, good peoples. Uh, well, this is going to look a little bit too bleached out. I I know that it's absolutely horrible and um, probably be burning a hole in your eyeball eye sockets. So yes, this row here or yeah, this row here. I don't know if I want to keep it to the to this shape or not. Uh, just because of that slope bit here. As you can see, you know, it's popping out there. I'm not too happy with the with that because of the way it transitions. Not too happy with it, so I don't know what I'm going to use across here. But for now, you know, this is what I'm going to be using. So yeah, that's going to be something like that. Um, over here, like, you know... We're supposed to have the center, center pole there. Unfortunately, we cannot make a center pole. Can we? 
Right, so the iron pole centered is actually made on the forge. The the numpty over there, he does have a forge, so he most probably could do a couple of those in the forge. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to try to do uh, once we get over to numpty over there. Hopefully everything should be stable, because we are sort of like hanging on that block there where the crosshair is. So if that block breaks... I don't know if everything is going to come crashing down or not, but hopefully you now I can try to get a bit more of the stabilizations going on around here. Um, so we shall see how I'm going to do that. So I can't make any wood buzz because I don't even have any wood. Yay me. Um, right. Farm up some wood. Okay, so hopefully we've got enough iron bars, uh, I mean wooden bars, to get our roof done. Okay, a uh, lot of see. So that's that roofy bit sorted out. Over here, not that happy with the way things are. One, two, three. Well, that is three high. A garage door is three high. So if I was to actually pop down some more slopes here, um, that might be okay, actually, I think. So I'm actually planning to pop down a garage door uh, here. You know, if we, can, if we survive until I get one, that is. So yeah. That's going to be the entrance bit to our little, you know, killing place so we come over here like that you know we can't fall through here uh, but we can mo definitely shoot through um, I don't know about throwing mollies through not too sure but I know if once we uh, get rid of these two not that one but these two and put the center pole down the middle uh, for sure we can be you know uh, have enough space to do that Hugh right, so it's 7 in the morning over here at our little basey of uh, Killing Spotness. We have a lot of work to do, however, I think what I really want to do is to get this upgraded to reinforced and then into steel. I know I've been saying, like, perhaps we should move this to another location on a more flatter surface. Um, but honestly, I think, you know, we'll just uh, keep going with what we have here on this uh, little incline that we've got, you know, going all the way down there. Oh, there's a zombie down there. Hello, Mr. Zombie. How's you doing? So, yeah. Uh, this is pretty much what we've got going so far. Down here, you know, I've got these little stair bits just to help the zombies get up and around here easier. So that I don't get stuck on things. Got a load of stuff that we need to, to gather. Need to gather a load of wood. Uh, to sort this area out. Who rate this? So as we've uh, ran out of wood once again, what I thought we should probably do is uh, come over to our little chest, grab some food, grab the steel, because I do want to upgrade our little killing spot uh, to steel. So that's probably what's going to be about, what, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 blocks perhaps? Hopefully we've got enough steel. Um, uh, mind you, it is day 7, so the trader has actually restocked. So we should go and see what he has. Well, hello there. Oh, excellent. And a level up. Let us actually see what we do have in terms of... Oh my god, we've got four points. Jeebus. Um, mm -mm -mm. Let us uh, get our deep cuts up. Uh, might as well get that up as well. Hidden strike. Run and gun. No, not yet. Flurry of blows. Uh, yeah. Let's see why not. And one into archery. Excellent. Okay, so we're back at our little camping spot. <laughs> 
totally, totally need to, you know, really focus on getting ourselves a little housey of some sort. Okay, so let us go and see what our friend has. Might be one of see what them. he has new for us. So now here, <laughs> you horrible shit. <laughs> <coughs> Now he has the iron pickaxe there for sale. So there's a cement mixer for 5,000 for sale, which is pretty nice. He's got a mini bike, which we could probably buy uh, if we sell a couple of things. We might be able to actually buy the, the mini bike. I think um, that's probably what I'm going to end up doing if we can get the cash. So yeah, that's the plan. So the plan is get some money. Oh crap, get some money means we have to get some missions. Do you have any uh, jobs? Oh my god, we're at tier 3. So we've got a clear zombies 200 and thingy doodle meters away. Not we bad. shall uh, try that. Let's get rid of some stuff on us. Okay, so here we are. I'm not going to run this place twice. Um, just because I think it's probably a little bit too big to do it twice. And the time of day. And it's also day 7. So I really want to sort some stuff out You know, on the base. Uh, for tonight's horde night as tonight is going to be you know one of the harsher ones okay so let us see what do we have waiting for us over hither nothing much i think we're going to loot and uh, move at the same time okay so nothing much going on here let's uh, bring our little friend out get rid of all this crap down here oh sugar yep So we've probably got a friend inside there waiting for us. Do we? Yes, we do. Missed the sneak shot on her. Oh well. Let's see what we have. Oh, got another treasure map. That's very nice. Hopefully, you know, there's going to be some nice uh, stuff in that. Okay, so nothing much happening in that room either. Uh, check that trash. Let us hop over to this. Get rid of that. Anything in the corners? No. A lot of trash on the floor to wake up the neighbors. So let's get rid of that stuff. Nothing under the bed. <laughs> That was unlocked. And we can also go this way. Ah. Decisions, decisions. Hopefully this is just a room. I uh, see this is a room that's going to be full of all the nasty things in the world. Or not. Okay, fine. Fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. No nasty things. Very good. Mind you, I should be looking at that compass up there, shouldn't I? Okay, five lockpicks later. And yeah, we got some trash. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Okay, so we have a friend over there. Can't get to their head, unfortunately. Can we do it like that? Yes, we can. Lovely explosion there. Brain explosion all over the place. I'm not really getting anything uh, interesting in terms of loot. Oopsie daisy. Oopsie. Okay. Another treasure map. Some shotty shells, get rid of that, and this junk. Oh, dearie me. Oh dear. Okay, so we can make military fiber now. That's actually pretty good because um, military fiber is, you know, used in the uh, light armor as well. Alright, so we came down from there. Cut. Stop it. Stupid thing. Thought he died, man. There you go. 
escaped. Actually, we should probably gather these wooden chairs because I am low on wood. I see ya. Oh dear. Really? Yeah, nothing much going on in there. Nothing much happening there either. Let's have a look. Do we have anyone in the corners? In the... Didn't I just reload that? Little swine. Little spider swine. Ready to call his uh, horrible friends. But hopefully he has not. Anything in this little pile? We already know that. Well, at least that's something to sell. Gets us a little bit closer to our mini bike goal for today, hopefully. So, six lock picks later, this better be worth it. Yeah, not well, yeah, I guess. Perhaps a little bit, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let's get this thing out of our face before it burns a hole in my goddamn eyes. Reload you. Do you have anything there? No, we don't. Looks like we've got a couple of peeps up the top. Excellent! Thank you for bringing that back to us. Okay, so there's a lot of noise going on. And an airdrop. Very good. Oh wow, today it's uh, hopefully going to be a good day for us. Hello there. I thought there was someone making noise. Excellent. Hopefully things will quieten down now he is uh, gone. Okay, some food. Our fat ass is getting stuck on things. Let me scoop all of this good stuff up. Okay, coming into the kitchen. No one is in said kitchen. Let's have a look, see if we can grab some food. Some good old nom noms. Well, that's a shame. There was absolutely no food at all in the kitchen. Right, so let's have a look down here. So this place is actually quite damn big, really. Looks like our luck is, whoopsie, very poor. Considering that looks like a bookshelf, but it's empty, so... Damn shame. Oh, hello there, Jesus Lord. The compound thing we do to use that. Use the snot out of that. How do we actually make that? Compound bow. So, bow crossbow parts, crap plumbers, leather duct tape, blah, blah, blah. Springs. Okay. We might be lucky. We might be lucky and we might be able to make that. Well, not that lucky in that. I was just some cat food, which I uh, quickly scoffed. Quickly smashed our face in with that can of cat food. <laughs> Righty. Absolutely nothing. Okay, so well, this room was an absolute bust as well. Nothing happened. Nothing uh, in terms of loot. I see that head. <laughs> Beautiful. And there you are, you're hiding behind the goddamn corner. Oh, you stupid stamina, now you have to quit on me? Seriously? Here's me trying to get my health up, and then the stamina just, yeah, nah. Not gonna, not gonna be there as soon as, you know, you're gonna be in front of a, a stupid zombie. <laughs> Bitchy gives me a pick. <laughs> ah, nah, gave me a wrench, and some of that. See, uh, some seal armor parts, leather boots. Oh, hello there, tempered blade mod, hunting uh, Niffy. Uh, not too bothered about hunting Niffy, not too bothered about that. Iron spear, 
we could repair it and sell it. Oh, hello, Polymer String Mod. Very good indeed. Um, hmm. Let's have a look in here. Oh, hmm. <laughs> now it gives me... <laughs> <laughs> I hate you, game. Honestly, that's the fourth one now from, uh, what was it, day five or day six. And that's the last little Zombert in this place. Very good. So we are all done here. Let us uh, get out. Okay, so let's see where these treasure maps are going. So we got a Sarah's treasure map. Let us see. Except. Where is that? Oh jeebus, right over there. And the other one. Taylor's. And right over there. Okay, fair enough. Let us pop into Mr. Trader Pants. So he wants to give me either another iron crossbow level 4 or this mining helmet. I think I'm going to go with the mining helmet. Yeah, I'm going to go with the Mining Helmet, so we'll complete that. Uh, may I see your inventory? Gonna sell. Sell. How the... That is... That's just well out of black, I guess. It's... Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm going to sell that. <laughs> I mean, at 7... It's nearly 800 there, so, you know, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to sell it. So, yeah, I think we might as well just buy this thing instead of farting around trying to put it together. Um, and there we go. And that's that. And we now have the mini bike. Yay! Let us also grab... Fetch clear 800. Fetch, fetch clear, fetch or fetch clear. You know what? We'll do the fetch clear, except... Uh, it is currently three. We should probably just quickly get some upgrades sorted out on the base. Do we even have any fuel after all that? <laughs> uh, oh yes, we do have some fuel. All right, that's good. I was going to say, like, oh crap, we don't even have any fuel for this thing. All right, let's pop you down uh, somewhere, please. Okay, excellent. So we now have a little, a little meat meat. We shall call it Meep. So yes, as it's about 1600 now, I don't know if we should try to attempt to take on another uh, Tier 3, Clear and Retrieve. So I think what we should probably try to do is, uh, well, I should probably try to gather up some resources, finish off upgrading those uh, wooden bits and bobs. So I will bring you guys back in a mo. <laughs> so we can actually get up there with the mini bike. That's awesome. All right, let's bring the hammer of hammer and us. Come over to this bit here, just in case I do forget. We want to definitely upgrade that. So it's ten per. Ah, oh, crapness. Oh well. At least we got some of it, you know, sorted out. Unfortunately, the trader doesn't have any more steel uh, for us to buy. And I totally left all the bloody cobblestone behind me because I'm absolute numpty. Now, I do know we have the level 1 chainsaw back in a chest. Uh, however, I am trying to look after the fuel for our mini bike for now. You know, until we get set up. <clears throat> a little better. Okay, so I think um, that's as far as I'm going to upgrade it for now. I think. Oh, crap. We still have a load of junk on us, don't we? So, yes. I uh, need to pop some stuff in the Trader's Forge. I keep on forgetting to do that. Uh, do we need to upgrade these? Let's at least get these up to level 2. This area shouldn't see any action, really. At all. Um, but what I'm going to do is just going to pop down um, stairs there. So, yes, hopefully this is going to be enough just to keep the zombies, you know, 
from getting stuck on crap and letting them, you know, come in nice and easily. Okay, so I think we might just have enough time to quickly go grab that uh, drop. I'm not too sure, to be honest. Okay, so that was quite the little journey there, but we should be able to make it in time. Eh, nothing much. Oh well. So we have a bear, some bear action going on down there in the water, probably hunting for some salmon. No, it's actually hunting for a zombie. Alrighty, so it is that time! Here they cometh! <laughs> Alrighty, so it looks like our turret is still able to take shots at stuff. Oh, don't we are thirsty already? So honestly, for these bits, I really don't know uh, what to show. Should I keep on showing myself swinging away at these numpties? Uh, hopefully I can get one of these off without killing myself. Excellent. So yeah, it looks like, you know, our little turret upstairs can uh, get some... Some of the zombies, but I really didn't want to waste him. Um, it's a uh, limited supply of uh, scrap that it has on them. Um, don't know how I'm going to work that one out, how to sort of like stop it or where to put it so it just only, you know, goes for the, for the birdies. So if you guys have any good ideas, please uh, let me know in the box in the down there. Ooh, loot. Oh, goody, some shotty kills. Very nice. Let's get some of this down there as well. Very nice. Very good indeed. There's some more loot for us. Let us see some. Oh, one of those. And some of them. We got a, we got a horrible, nasty little spidery thing down there. Let's get him in the backside. Very good. Take out, out, stop that crap. Take out these idiots. I mean, we do have the AK as well. We can most definitely use the AK, but I was thinking, like, you know, better save the ammo for now. I don't know, really. Uh, let's just bring the AK down there. Uh, oh, crap. <laughs> like, Ipsy. Get rid of that doggo before he caused an absolute panic with the zombies, you know, giving them something to stand on. It's not something that I want happening. So yes, please, you know, leave me your thoughts, comments and ideas as to, you know, how should I show a zo the zombie knights? I mean, currently, yeah, currently it is kind of dull, just me standing here, whacking away at these idiots until the stamina goes down. Well, it will go down if I actually use some power attacks. Uh, sort for that, please. Get the doggy, please. Did we get the doggy? No, we did not get the doggy. Alright, doggy's gone. Yeah, let's have some AK fun. <laughs> oh, that's, that was beautiful. Awesome, just spray the circle, man. You get everything. Lovely stuff. So yes, the mollies are also going to be beautiful work in here, as you saw, um, you know, just starting off this little horde night. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, see, talk. See what I mean? With the stupid dogs? <laughs> Alrighty, that's, uh, keep on whacking away. I mean, there's no point in actually wasting all the ammo in the world, really, right now. As long as I don't get any uh, zombie coppers, and that's another thing, unfortunately I can't block the zombie cops. Uh, because the zombie cops are actually the same height as the rest, of, well, as these little guys down here. He is uh, two meters high. So I can't really block him. I can block the demos from coming, uh, you know, setting something up so I can just block the demos from coming in. And uh, hopefully a little method of uh, dropping them at least those ones down somewhere to get rid of. Hello? Zombies? Oh, hello! 
Here you are. It took you guys a while. <laughs> Beautiful. Love it. So yeah, I might as well save the ammo though. So I guess after the day seven sword, so when uh, Trader Pants opens up, I'm going to be chucking a load of stuff into his uh, single forge that he has there. Um, you know, start to smelt up some, uh, get some forged iron at least going so we can make some more repair kits because I'm low on repair kits now. Okay, yeah, I'm going to quickly repair our little machetness and swap to the to the thing. So our little shotty here. Get rid of those two. Reload our PK of funness. Uh, hello. Uh, hello. That couldn't have been it. You're joking, right? Let's just... Oops. That can't be it, man. There are, oh yeah, we've got that stupid chest there. That's, uh, yeah, that's a bit annoying. Nah, are you joking? It's not joking, you know. It's totally not joking, it said. And I'm saying, but are you sure? There's 2300 sugar crapness lumps and everything else. You see, you stupid turret. Why did. Oh my god, look at all of those stupid birds. Stupid pigeons. Hate you, stupid things. You're worse than the stupid dogs. Thank you. Go away. Is that gonna. Oh crapness. Is that gonna. There you go, stupid, stupid pigeon. Is that gonna trigger? The rest of the waves, perhaps? No. No, it said. It said that is it. You've had your lot. No more no more zombies for you, good sir. You've you've had your fun. Oh well, that's a goddamn shame. Honestly thought we were gonna have much, much more as it's day seven. Day seven we it's it, uh, I'm speechless once more. We are on a maximum of sixty-four zombies. Um, really thought that we were going to see much more. I'm still shocked. I am really surprised with this. Well, that's the kind of junk that we picked up from this Horde Knight. We got uh, literally a junk turret. So I'm going to actually scrap that for the parts. Um, some bullet casing, some beers. So yeah, unfortunately I'm going to have to call it here on this one, my awesome YouTube units. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed a bit of building. We did one little uh, mission today. Got the mini bike. Um, sorted out the base out a bit more as well. So yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And if you have, please remember to smash that like and subscribe on like they owe you money. So for now, uh, take care. And I'll catch you all on the next one.